I'm Steve Everett, Applications Engineer at Tektronix, and today I'm going to show you how to do the fastest possible local scans on the DAC 6510 using our scan cards, the 7700 and the 7710. All right, now we're going to show the fastest possible local scan with the 7700 card. We're going to go to Build Scan, and for this test, we're going to use channels 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, and DC volts. We're going to want to set our range to be a fixed range, in this case 1 volt. We're going to want to set our NPLC settings to the lowest possible, which would be 0 0.0005. We will want to make sure that auto zero is off, and that all of the calculations are also off, as well as no channel delay. Then we'll go into the scan menu. For the scan, we'll do 50 scans. Make sure that there is no scan to scan interval. Alright, now we can start the scan. Now if we go to menu and reading table, you'll be able to see all the data as well as the timestamps for each one. And you'll notice that you'll get about 80 to 81 scans per second. Alright, now we'll show off the 7710 solid state card. This one should be much faster, and it's the same steps as the last one. We're going to build our scan, and make sure that we're in fixed range, that our NPLC settings are down to 0 .005, 0 0.005, excuse me, that auto zero is off, and that all of our calculations are off, and we have no channel delay. Next, we'll go into the scan menu. For this one, we will also do 50 scans make sure that we have no scan to scan interval and then we'll start the scan it is already done you'll notice that you don't hear any clicking since it's a solid state card go to the reading table and you'll see that we got all 250 readings and you'll get about 1040 1041 readings per second with this card all right that's how you do the fastest local scans on the DAC 6510 as always, if you have any other questions, feel free to contact Tektronix Customer Support. We'd be happy to help.